We're here with Katie Ingram here at Maxi Fuels Beat Your Best uh, Day here in Loughborough. So Katie, how are you helping out today? Uh, well, today I've been asked to come along just to kind of give some advice and some tips to uh, these guys who are all taking part in triathlon or some of them are quite new to it. So basically my role is to just give them a few kind of inside techniques on what would help them in racing and in training. Yeah, and obviously um, at the moment, obviously, obviously they're on the turbos. So what are they doing at the moment? At the moment, they're practicing uh, bike to run sessions, so we're just trying to simulate the just sort of jelly like feeling you get as you're running off the bike. Uh, obviously, it's a lot different to running fresh, so we're trying to talk to the guys a lot about trying to maintain good posture for the first sort of few k of the run and trying to really work on the cadence and get the, the legs going even if they don't feel great. So, we're trying to really burn the legs and they're going to do a few squats after this before they run as well. Great, and obviously, they were working on transition a little bit earlier today. Yes. Um, any kind of your top tips from you on how to get the best, uh, the perfect transition? Uh, transition is very much about being very organised, so make sure you get to the race plen in plenty of time so you can basically look at the transition area, make sure you know where the sort of entrance and exits are. Uh, make sure you've got your bike in obviously the right rack and you know where that is. Uh, things like that before the race are, are really key to making sure you, your actual transition in the race goes well. And I'd say during the race, rather than panicking and ending up doing things really fast and making a mess, you're better off just sometimes taking a, a little step back, taking a, a bit of a breather and just doing it more controlled and at a slightly slower pace and that way you'll find it goes a lot smoother. Yep. Um, now obviously after this session the, the guys are going to have a bit of a bit of a swim in the, the pool across the road. What's um, what any idea, any tips on how to improve their swim technique? Uh, the session that they're doing today is going to be working on some sort of open water skills. So we're going to be looking at sort of drafting and how to sight. Even though we're training in the pool for this, you can still practice these things. So um, I think it's just going to be really good for the guys to actually see what other tips and techniques you need for open water swimming because it is very different to pool swimming and learning how to draft off each other. Brilliant. And obviously we've got Olympic years coming up uh, next season. What's it like being part of a British team that's just building up to that event and being part of that, that squad? Yeah, it's, it's really exciting for British Triathlon uh, coming into 2012. We've obviously got a uh, great lot of talent in, uh, in Britain and to be around and amongst all of that is very exciting and obviously the home games is just really emphasising the sport of British Triathlon. It's looking forward and exciting to see if we can get some medals. Brilliant. Thanks, Katie.